हेलो एंड वेलकम टू माय चैनल फार्मेसी इन डेप्थ वेर विल टॉक अबाउट फार्मेसी रिलेटेड टॉपिक्स इन डिटेल टुडे वी विल टॉक अबाउट डिफरेंट टाइप्स ऑफ इंटेलेक्चुअल प्रॉपर्टी राइट्स लाइक पेटेंट्स ट्रेडमार्क्स कॉपीराइट्स ट्रेड सीक्रेट्स जोग्राफिकल इंडिकेशंस एंड अदर्स फर्स्ट लेट्स अंडरस्टैंड व्हाट इज एन इंटेलेक्चुअल प्रॉपर्टी सो एन इंटेलेक्चुअल प्रॉपर्टी इज अ प्रॉपर्टी व्हिच अराइजेस फ्रॉम अ ह्यूमन इंटेलेक्ट it is a product of human creation like a pen or a car or it can be any literary form like a poem a book or it can be a process of manufacturing a product but why do you require any rights to protect these intellectual properties let's understand this with a simple example suppose you are an inventor and after years of research and hard work you have created a pen with multiple refills and it is the first in the world but as soon as you release it in the market or try to sell it you will see that after some time many people will try to copy it and will sell at a very cheaper rate because they have not invested in research by this you will be very demotivated so how can you exclude others from copying your invention as you are the first inventor and you would also like to be rewarded for that so that will keep you motivated for inventing further this exclusivity and reward is given by various types of intellectual property rights intellectual property rights are divided in two groups the first one is literary and artistic works and it includes copyrights the second group consists of industrial property and it includes patents industrial design trademarks trade secrets layout designs and geographical indications there is one more way of classifying it so if you have an invention so you can get a patent utility models and trade secrets for that if you have a creative work then you can get copyrights and design rights for that if you have a brand name or a logo then you can have a trademark copyright and design rights for that if it is a confidential information then you can get trade secrets and if it is a design then you can get design rights and copyrights for that so let's begin with copyrights so copyright is the exclusive right which grants the protection of unique expression of ideas ideas which are expressed in form of literature films drama music arts and sound recordings the duration for which a copyright is valid in case of books it is author's life plus 60 years in case of photographs and films it is 60 years and in case of broadcastings it is 25 years from the date of filing the objective of granting a copyright is to encourage authors composers and artists to create their original work by rewarding them exclusive rights for a specific period of time to reproduce their work for publishing and selling to the public the ownership of a copyright lies with the author in case of literature and drama in case of musical work it lies with the composer in case of a photograph it lies with the photographer in case of cinematograph work it lies with the film producer and in case of sound recording it lies with the producer now let's understand what is a patent a patent is an exclusive right given by the government for being the first inventor of a product or a process it is given for a limited period of 20 years from the date of filing it excludes others from making selling using or importing the patented product or the process without the consent of the inventor and a patent is granted in exchange of the full disclosure about the invention but what are the requirements to get a patent so the product or the process should be novel that means new it should be not obvious it should have a utility value and a patent is granted in exchange of the full written disclosure about the invention and what all can be patented so a product a process an apparatus for producing the product and the composition of matter can be patented but the things which cannot be patented are discoveries computer programs medical and surgical treatments mathematical methods business methods new species of a plant or an animal and inventions related to atomic energies cannot be patented there are four patent offices in india one at delhi chennai kolkata and mumbai where you file the application for patent 
and if you fit in all the criteria they will grant you a patent next is a trademark a trademark is a symbol a logo a word a sound a color or a design that is used to identify a business or a product in commerce tm is for unregistered trademarks and is used for products sm is for unregistered service marks and is used for service and r is for registered trademarks the example for tm and sm are bmw and urban club respectively the validity of a trademark is 10 years from the date of application and it is renewed further 10 years after paying the renewal fees similarly service marks are valid for 17 years and also can be renewed after paying the renewal fees next type of intellectual property right is trade secret it consists of a formula a device an idea a process a pattern or a compilation of informations that gives the owner a competitive advantage in the marketplace it is a novel idea that is not a common knowledge and is kept in a confidential state it is not protected by the law and can only be protected through employment contracts and maintaining tight security the famous example of trade secret is the secret recipe of coca cola Although they have mentioned everything on the label but added natural flavoring substance is still kept a secret. Many companies have tried to copy the formula but have not been succeeded in getting the exact taste as that of Coca-Cola. The taste of Coca-Cola and thumbs up are also different. Other examples of trade secrets are Google search algorithm, KFC chicken, Listerine formula and McDonald sauces. next is geographical indications so a gi is an indication originating from a definite geographical territory and is used to identify agricultural natural or manufactured goods the manufactured goods should be produced processed or prepared in that territory only and it should have a special quality or a reputation some famous examples of geographical indications includes kanchipuram sari kolapuri chappal nagpur oranges agra petha darjeeling tea and tirupati laddu an authorized user has the exclusive right to use the gi in relation to the registered goods a gi is valid for a period of 10 years and can be extended further by paying the renewal fees and the last one is the industrial design it is the protection given only on the design of an article and not on how it works but the article must have an industrial or commercial use a design refers to the features of shape configuration pattern ornamentation or composition of lines or colors applied to any article in 2d or 3d or both forms Some examples of industrial design include the design of a Coca-Cola bottle, the design of a Tupperware bottle, or the design of a Vespa scooter. So guys, this was all about different types of intellectual property rights. Thanks for watching the video. I really hope you liked it. And if you did, like it, share it and subscribe to my channel.